Yo guys, what's up, Soulfly? Welcome back to the newest video. First off, I want to address what's in the background. Um, that's a that's a TV, and this entire place is the living room. I'm literally on a dining table at my grandparents playing Call of Duty with my entire setup. No joke, I have everything here. My Mac, PlayStation, Xbox, my Rubik's Cube, mic, and then there's me just sitting here. And my hair looks like garbage. I should have done something after I got out of the shower. I am very upset. Very upset. I'm gonna fix the camera. I just saw the most disturbing thing in my entire life. See if I can find a game and I'll talk about this. I had an entirely different video planned for this. I was gonna talk about my middle school experiences. That'll probably be the video after this. The title, you can tell. You can tell what I'm gonna talk about. This isn't fake. Unless an entire news station decided to make a fake video. And if they made a fake video about something like this, there's a problem. This title reads, McDonald's employee gives birth and tries to flush infant down toilet. Down the toilet! Thank God for studio, because right now this is the only thing saving me from just, I don't know, flipping everything. This stuff will set me off, oof. Oh, we're in a modded lobby. Holy crap. Can I get some snipes? Come on. I swear, if I can hit a clip in a modded lobby. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm gonna play this, enjoy the modded lobby. I have no idea what's going on. I watched this little news broadcast video that it's put on the site. I'm gonna leave the link down below if you guys wanna read all this or look at the video. This is insane. This is, I, I can't wrap my mind around it. So this lady works at a McDonald's first off. You can tell by the title and everything. She says she doesn't know she was pregnant. This lady is 25. 25 years old, has another kid, and says she doesn't know she was pregnant. From what everyone says that works with her, they said they didn't know that she was pregnant either. And that leads me to think only one thing. Either this chick, the, the baby wasn't a, you didn't have a big baby bump, because if you're pregnant, especially for a couple months, you're gonna, you're gonna have a noticeable bump. Unless, I mean, some people just don't have one. Either that, or I hate to say it, you're probably overweight. It's just a known fact, like I, I said, I'm gonna be honest in these videos, I'm not gonna hide anything. So if you can't tell that there's a bump, either she has more of a bump already, or there's just not a noticeable one. This guy, Random's Toe, I've played with this dude before. How did I even get that dude? So, she was complaining about stomach pains. I feel like if you've already had a kid, you would know what a second one feels like. You would know if you're pregnant. But the fact that she had another kid and was saying she felt like stomach pains, I think you would know. I don't know. I'm a guy. Of course, I don't know all this stuff. Hey, if you have one kid, you're probably going to know if you're going to have another. I could have just hit a, a triple with all these guys. There's way too many people here. So this lady, this girl complains about stomach pains, goes to the bathroom, and decides, you know what? This lady gives birth in a bathroom. In a bathroom! I don't know what was going on in her head, but I she didn't want this kid at all. Since she had complained about stomach pains, other people decided to go check on her after a while. They said that there was blood on the ground, and that somebody saw the baby's face. This lady had given birth in the bathroom, and decided she was going to try to push the kid down the toilet. She was found pushing the kid in the water. The little baby boy in the water. I'm literally just like Josh whenever it comes to getting upset or excited over something, I say it like three times. If I had one of those game spheres, I'd be saying spherical right now. Spherical! Whew. And I'm, just, I'm trying to be a little funny to crack some jokes here and there because this is just, this topic is insane. We live in the weirdest world. Think about it, we're having hurricanes, all kinds of events happening, earthquakes, giant fires, people pushing babies in toilets. I don't know what her idea was. She, I don't know what she thought she was going to do after pushing this kid in the toilet and potentially killing him. What do you do? She, what she think was going to happen? Nobody was going to find that? I'm sure that they could have done a test to see, I don't know, if somebody was pregnant who went in the bathroom. There's They have surveillance for this kind of thing. Not in the bathroom, of course, but on the outside, they can tell when somebody goes in the bathroom and when something was found. They're going to know who the last person was. She could escape this regardless. Then the district attorney was talking about all this and said that no one had known she was pregnant. Nobody knew she would do anything like this. It just goes to show you that you don't know people. I mean, you could think you know somebody. Even her neighbors were like, oh yeah, she'd never do this. One of them even thought that she, they still didn't believe she did this. They were trying to find out who the father was 
and she was living with a boyfriend at the time, so that means she got around. This lady is all kinds of messed up. I'm trying to breathe slowly and kind of reduce my anger level with this because I'm talking entirely too fast. Like I said, I had an entirely different video planned out for this. I have no idea how long this one's gonna be, but man. How does someone grow up to think anything like that is okay? Me being a young adult, we have to have people to look up to. I hope she didn't have anybody looking up to her. Luckily, the boy survived. The little baby did survive. They had to give it mouth to mouth or they had to resuscitate it some way. I'm not sure exactly how you would resuscitate a newborn baby considering like you can't push on their chest. They're born, their bones are still like soft. And migrating host. We probably just got kicked out of this game. No, we're still here. I think the modder, no, is he still here? I think it's that dude. Oh, I thought he reset the match. Whew. Oh, it's so slow now. Is this like extra slow or is this normal? Oh, ew. Uh, did he hit? This guy has to have aimbot. I feel like it's the guy, no, it's not the guy I just saw. Nice. Great way to end the game. Ugh. I hate the fact that someday this kid is going to be told this story. It's got to come up at some point. Either someone's, someone's going to adopt him, he's going to go to somebody within the family, and they're not going to have any contact with his mom, and he's going to be told one day this story. My heart goes out to that dude because, man, in a couple of years, that's, that's going to send him through all kinds of loops. That's the kind of stuff that runs through my mind whenever something like this happens to somebody. I'm cutting the video off here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I'm going to try to record this other video, kind of breathe a little bit, and uh, let all the anger out. I'm going to go play some more games or do something. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please go down and hit that subscription button as well as the notification bell to stay updated on all my videos. Stay tuned for the next video. I'm going to make an announcement about who's making my beats for all my future videos. Some of you guys may know who I was using before. His link was down in the description. Go down there and make sure to check out my links. I'll be talking more in depth about that in the next one. If you guys enjoyed this video, please like, favorite, comment, subscribe. Make sure to go down and hit that notification bell. As always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Crazy people at McDonald's can do everything there but fix the ice cream machine.